The kill through the middle when Risa was free over to his left. And Risa with room to operate in has been calling for it long and hard and hits a magnificent opening inside 45 seconds. The quickest goal ever in the League Cup final. John Arnorisa hits a rocket. Here comes Lampard. Through the wall, but straight into the midriff of Jersey Dudek. There's a chance now for Drogba, who stayed on side. But he got away with it, and Le Liverpool on the back for Drogba. Corner. Now whether it's the keeper or a carrier, there's certainly someone gets a little bit of this ball. And again by Duff, Terry's header. Off the line. Good Johnson, good save, Gallus, good save again. Well, a goalkeeper that's taken so much stick from Liverpool fans has just come to the rescue. But this precious moment, this is a lovely ball. Morientes looks to work it through to Luis Garcia. Her man's made a break and he's found him. Wonderful save, wonderful stop. A what a hit. Then book Didi Haman if you must. Oh, the kick has gone in, it's an own goal. Steven Gerrard. The Liverpool captain sees it flick in. Remarkably, Chelsea have got their equaliser from a most unlikely source. Jose Mourinho is not going to see the end of this game from the touchline. He's been sent off. Nice ball to Damien Duff. Needs a good cross. Drogba off the post and away. Great ball by Damien Duff. Back over in that favoured left position. Superb cross. Half cleared by. Risa, Kesman, who's away from Herman, he's done well. Still going, Kesman, tries to curl in the shot and well saved by Dude. Better from Kesman. Yeah, he's looked confident since he came on and... Uh... Johnson's long throw and it's gone through to Drogba! Didier Drogba, the man who was bought as a club record signing with £24 million pounds worth of Roman Abramovich is in. Dudek flaps at it, it's Ida Gudjonsson back in, and it's stabbed in by Mattia Kejman of all people, the man who has so struggled for goals in his time at Chelsea, gets a big one in the big one, and Chelsea are closing in on the Carling Cup. Gerrard's kick. Oh, and it's turned in! Nunes! Amongst those in the pile, got the touch. Chelsea win their first silverware under Jose Mourinho, but the manager is not pitch side to see it and join in the celebratory party. He's a cup winning captain. League Cup, the Carling Cup as it is now. Jose Mourinho, it was the first trophy that he's lifted as the Chelsea manager. Arsenal sixth appearance in the final, they've won it twice in the days of George Graham, Chelsea playing in the final for the fifth time, they've won it on three occasions. Faced by Bridge, oh the little flick back heel didn't work, and the first shot comes in from Fabregas, didn't seriously test Fedor Cech. But what it will do, it'll give this Arsenal side some confidence. Batista uses his strength on his left foot, chance here! Chelsea have scrambled it Good away. Turn. Oh, Czech has to come out and fall on it and smother it, but there's some impressive football being put together by Arsenal in these early moments. Has he got sight of goal? Here he has! Oh, what a strike from the player who scored six times in only two appearances in this League Cup competition, four of them against Liverpool in the quarter-final. Oh, they've got it through this time, and they've scored! And who is it? It's Theo Walcott! It's his first ever Arsenal goal. It's his first goal for over a year. The last one he scored was for Southampton. And Arsenal have got the breakthrough early. And what a turn up. It's the 17 year old. He cuts it across Baptista. Oh, was it a penalty? No. The first big decision for Howard Webb. And he shakes his head. Well, that must have been close. Chelsea are looking for inspiration. Can Balak provide it? There's no offside flag. Here's Drogba, and it's level! Drogba gets his 27th goal of the season, the top scorer in the English Premiership, and you have to wonder about Arsenal's defending. 
well, they're looking to try and hold a high line there to play him offside. And I don't think there's any daylight between Senderos there and Drogba, so quite right, another good decision, but... Oh, Baptista's peeled away, and he was denied by Pedacek coming quickly off his goal line. Excellent goal. Snatched across from here, there was no offside flag. Shevchenko gets the header. It's a good chance. Oh, it's got away from Pedacek. It's going to be a goal kick. And he's wearing that skull crack. There's a great break on here. He's got Cavallio backpedalling. Has he got side of goal? Great foot in by Cavallio. Absolutely outstanding. It was a fantastic really tackle. Oh, it's right across the face of goal. Fabregas just missing the far post. Well, a lovely interplay here, Justin Hoyton and Fabregas. Threads it through for Drogba, who's goal side of Senderos. Saved by Almunier, but he's grateful that no blue shirt was coming in on it because it got two yards away from him. People ever since he came on. Lampard from distance. Oh, and he's hit the top of the crossbar. What quality from the highest scoring midfield player in Chelsea's history. Well, we haven't seen an awful lot of Frank in an attacking situation. Out to Robin, to run at a buoy. Chipped in, Drogba gets a glancing header, and it's a wonderful goal by Drogba, and he puts Chelsea ahead with just over six minutes left, plus whatever time he's added. And that's goal number 28 for the season for the Chelsea striker. Well, it, it was a fantastic Very experienced Chelsea side, and there's Shevchenko, and he smashed that against the angle of post and bar. Well, we haven't seen a lot of him in this game, and I've been quite disappointed. And there's the final whistle, and Chelsea have come from behind with two goals from Didier Drogba to win the Carling Cup final for his medal. Of course, the second one being the winning goal to win that trophy. Chelsea are the winners of the Carling Cup final after an explosive final here at the Millennium Stadium in Cardiff. Feel the noise, folks. What an occasion. Chelsea versus Tottenham. It doesn't need the hype and the fireworks. It doesn't need subplots. It's got both today on top of everything. Oh, that's a good-looking cross. And just about Hugo Lloris got there, but only just. Takes, I think it takes a wicked deflection. Which comes in now and does find Ivanovic. You wouldn't bet against it, would you? Five in seven. He's absolutely prolific. Here comes Christian Eriksen. Oh, it's very good. It had Czech beaten this off the woodwork. And the follow-up is a wild slash. And... Oh, it's flicked on its hit. Zuma, oh, it must be, it is! And look who scored it! It's John Terry in front of the Tottenham fans! Loris thought about coming. Ivanovic does not it back across. It nearly was a second Chelsea goal. Couldn't quite get enough power on it. Loris to his Taking credit. On the cropped walker. And Hazard does get the ball across. It somehow evaded everybody. Oh, it's a Chelsea Lights throw. Are on and the rain's falling now. There's the Zuma jump. Fabregas with the overhead. Goodness me, what an effort that was. Well, you Norris see... had an ace to watch it, Jason, but he still <laughs> took some saving. Time to go. Here's Costa looking for that sniff of goal. Oh, deflection, and he's done it. Diego Costa's first Chelsea goal outside of the Premier League is a massive one at Wembley. Chelsea two, Tottenham nil. Oh, nonchalance there, and Hazard's curled it. We had a very nice angle on that. I think Loris had it. <laughs> and Jose there. Blue is the colour at Wembley again. Here we go. The Capital One Cup has 